In DaVinci Resolve, when we bring a clip that has both video and audio into the timeline, both the video portion and audio portion of the clip are linked together by default. And both the video clip and the audio clip are treated as a single clip, as they should be. But when you have multiple clips in a sequence like this, each clip is still to a large extent independent of each other. So if you want to link them together, what you can do is to select multiple clips and then uh, right click in the menu, select link clips, or you can use keyboard shortcut option command L that will link all these clips together as a single clip. And a huge advantage of this is that, as you can see, all these clips now can be moved or edited uh, together at once. And you don't have to worry about the video portion or the audio portion being accidentally out of sync. And to unlink the clip, all we can do is to select the clip again and then right click in the menu, uncheck link clips, or simply use the keyboard shortcut option command L again. Uh, this will unlink this entire sequence. But you, what you will also notice is that each individual clip is also no longer linked to each other uh, because they no longer have the chain sign. And this brings us to our next topic. In DaVinci Resolve, you can unlink any clip by simply right click the clip and then in the menu, uncheck link clips. And now the video portion and audio portion can be edited independently. Now to bring everything back, what you need to do is to simply select both the video and audio portion and then right click in the menu, select link clips. Now they're back as a linked clip. And now back to our previous example here, since they're unlinked, you can pretty much do anything you want to the video or the audio portion of the sequence. And then once you're done, simply to link all of them together again, just make sure you select all these clips and then right click in the menu, select link clips. Now they're back to as a single clip uh, that can be edited and moved uh, all at once. And if you want to just bring back each individual clip, what you need to do is just to select the audio and the video portion of each clip and then select uh, link clips. Now they're back uh, to their original linked format. And lastly, another common application of this is to substitute the video or the audio portion of a clip with a brand new clip. So for our video clip right here, we're going to uncheck link clips and then we're going to remove this audio file and then replace it with a brand new audio clip. So once we're done, uh, we can simply select the audio and the video and then right click, select cli uh, link clips. So now the audio and the video clip are synced up as a single video clip that can be edited or moved together. So I hope this helps guys and I will see you next time.